Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back to more Yu-Gi-Oh! It's me, Cooper, and today, we're going to be taking on another Tier 3 opponent, and this time, I think we're gonna fight Strings. I don't want to, because he was really hard the first time I fought him, but we're gonna try. Ugh, price scissors. Oh, he got me! Oh, but you let me go first. Thank you, sir. You're a very kind puppet. I appreciate that. So, Strings has one of the stronger decks that we fought, so... Let's see if I can beat him in power. Neo, go. What do you got? Mmm, that's very uncomfortable. How is every opponent starting with swords nowadays? I really don't like swords. I mean, I love it when I have it, but I really hate it when my opponent has it, because I can't do much about it. Alright, looks like we're going to have to deal with swords, which means we're probably going to have to deal with Summon Skull. Which is why we already set up on him. Yo, Dungeon Worm barely beats me, but it does work. Alright, Neo, sorry I couldn't protect you, buddy. If I could have, I would have, but I couldn't. Seven card fish, funny enough, can protect us, so... We're gonna summon the fish as protection, and we're gonna just wait out the swords. Okay, that card's horrible. <laughs> that, that card is absolutely horrible. I remember it from Starter Deck Kaiba. Um, get, get, get out of here. You can get out of here too, sir. Thank you. Uh, let's go ahead and draw. Trap hole will buy us time. And just in case things go wrong, I swear to God, if he plays Heavy Storm or something, I'm going to be pissed. Because Swords is gone and I'm going to try and hurt him. No! You monster! If I could kill you, I would. <laughs> you son of a bitch, how could you? How could you? What evil are you? Or at least he at least he didn't draw any spells or traps. That's the good news. Hey, I got my pot of greed. Oh, I'm gonna make you pay for what you just did. I lost Monster Born, I lost Change of Heart, I lost my life. Everything I cared about. My family was in that hand. My family was on that back row. How could you? Alright, seven colored mass sorcerer makes the most sense. Let's go with it. And uh, let's see what I get. MST, I won't need it. Uh, seven tools, mirror force. Yep, we're good. Oh my gosh, I'm so upset right now. No matter what, he's got a good hand, so let's just be prepared for a good hand. I know a lot of people cringed when they saw the Harpy's Feather Duster. I know you did. You felt the same way I did, because you're human beings with actual, actual human emotions. What you just felt was loss. Well, this is also lost, but I don't feel as bad about it. I also lost Stop Defense, which most of you are crying about. You better be crying about Stop Defense. That card's awesome. Alright, I do have an MST, so I might as well. Yeah, you never know what you're going to run into. I know I have seven tools, but let's just play it safe. Is it a Mirror Force, just so I don't have to deal with Mirror Force anymore? No, interesting. Magic Thorn. Does that imply that he's about to use... What I think he's about to use? You know, I'm curious enough to find out. Is that a morphing jar? Slash something else? Holy shit, it was! Alright, we're playing with no hands here. I mean, we're playing with uh, no decks in this one. Uh, Giant True Nate is perfect for this opponent. This is one of those awkward times where I'm going to have to use Giant Soldier of Stone like a beater monster, aren't I? Yep. I'm not getting uh, my best spells and traps because they got thrown or they got harpies a long time ago. I have to make do with my basic spells and traps, like Corn of the Unicorn. Your force is not basic, though. I understand that. Okay, two back row now. All of a sudden, that's uncomfortable. Uh, I have a giant true nade, though. If I think it's going to be a problem, I have a giant true nade. You know what? Let's assume it's going to be a problem. Assumptions will help in this case. That's good. That's good. Force him to throw away cards. And now Seven Tools is a lot safer. Look at that. I like it. Um, that does mean I don't get the flip effect, though. So because I'm in a weird situation, let me get called a Haunted Ruddy. It's like, but Cooper, now you can't play cards. I'm probably about to lose Seven Tools, so it's fine if I can't play cards. Let's go ahead and get rid of this card. Like I said, <laughs> I'm about to lose seven tools, so I have space. 
Mirror Force is crazy, but I also have Might on the field, so I understand. Let's see what card you were protecting. Oh, you person. You evil, evil person. That's your second banishment. And you're forcing me to draw this again. Oh my gosh. You are a bad person, and I don't like you. Alright, well... Skull Angel can help me draw. I knew this tier 3 opponent. This Strings, he knows how to play. He's giving me more trouble than most of these opponents. Alright, let's see what I can get now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm going to set Skellingel, and I'm going to trust that Skellingel will get me a monster. Because I'm ending this. We're banishing everything. Oh, good. Banishing that card counters its effect. Get wrecked. Get absolutely wrecked. Yeah, how do you like it? I pulled my own. Now what are you going to do with about it? Do I have anything good in the grave now that I think about it monster-wise? Anything worth the call of the haunted? Seven card fish is the best, and I'm good. I can wait. I can wait till I run out. He already used Harpy's Feather Duster. I'm not worried anymore. Okay, what else you got? Jesus. Eventually, you're going to run out of stuff. Oh, crap, a new trap. It's not going to be a problem, though. Swords again. I love it. Now it's time for me to be a dick. He's like, what, you got two swords? Yeah, my mom lets me have two swords. I have Machine King. I like this. I like this a lot. Let's find out if he has a flip effect before I walk into this. Nope, he's just terrible. Alright, we are going to summon the Machine King to try and bait out a trap card. Sorry, Skellendrel. Trap hole? No. Okay, well, we're going to get rid of his card. One way or another, it's going to leave the field. Looks like it's going to the grave. Alright, I could go in directly, but it's fine. I'd like to get the Machine King back in case he dies. Let's see what my opponent does. Strings, strings, strings. Okay. 13 cards left in my deck. I need to hurry up. Alright, I summon Mystical Elf in attack mode. I'm not playing defensive anymore. I'm tired of defense mode. I'm still afraid of what these flip effect monsters could be, but I have to play through them. Oh, yeah, this is a problem. This is, uh... I need you to hit a boss monster right now. You know what? I'm gonna activate Call of the Haunted no matter what. I assume you hit a boss monster. I'm just tired of waiting. I am tired of waiting. I need to win before I deck out. I have, what? I, I don't remember how many cards I have. Summon Skull. Knew you would hit something good. Shit. You know what? It sucks that I lost Call of the Haunted, but I did a thousand burns, so I'll just take that. I'll take that home with me. Now I just gotta hope that he goes after my Mystical Elf. Oh, wait, I have swords up. He won't. Oh, dear God. How many cards do I got left? I have seven cards left. If he gets another Needle Worm, I'm in so much trouble. All right. Let's just go for game. We're going for game on this turn right now. Machine King can win me the duel. That just cannot be a, like a Morphing Jar number two. That would be the one thing to kill me. Okay. That's good. Dark Elf is an insanely powerful card, but I'm stronger. Okay, with six or yeah, six cards left in my deck, I have defeated Strings. He is definitely a fun opponent that gives me a lot of stress. And you know what? For beating Strings, I'm gonna get uh, let's go with this pack. Fake trap. That's not even bad. I've ran it before. I should probably run it again to stop this other stuff that happens to me. Um, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do. I want to do Esperoba. Don't get me wrong, I want to. The reason we're not is because I keep getting him in the weekend tournaments, and I don't know if the game's glitched, because it's happened three times out of, like, four or five. Um, but it's happened too often now. I think everyone should keep count on that. So I'm just gonna... I'm gonna go with Mystical Elf. Rex gets one of his best monsters. I can't uh, disrespect that. Luckily for me, I got my Mystical Elf. Alright, I draw. Summon Skull's really good. Neo the Magic Swordsman is a better play right now, though. The reason I'm doing this is because I feel a Dark Hole coming. I don't know why specifically Dark Hole, but it feels like a Dark Hole's coming. And I don't exactly... Oh, I do have Magic Jammer. I don't exactly want to get hit by it. Oh, that's interesting. What is he going for? Is he going for Mega Zowler? No, I want to see if he goes for it. Oh, but he put it in defense mode. That was dumb. But he might put a different monster in attack mode. Yep. His mom lets him F2. Not even mad. That's impressive. 
I could have stopped this at any time, and I chose not to, because I'm a good person. Alright, I draw. Fisher's fun, but not necessary. Now this card is necessary. Unless I draw my own dino cards. I need my two-headed King Rex, or my Crawling Dragon. Summon Skull is going to go in, and Summon Skull is going to put a quick end to Crawling Dragon number two. And then we're going to end our turn. What else you got, kid? Damn you. Alright, you better not have a spell after that. Ah! Oh, I would totally magic jammer that! Holy crap, that's annoying. Oh, you are on my list. You are on my list right now. I don't know what it's like, but the past, like, couple episodes, I've been running into duelists that are just... Oh, I trapped it on. That are just making me suffer swords. I don't know what's going on, though. Skellinger will help me get an MST, please. Dear God. What I would do for an MST right now. Thank you, game. That's exactly what I was asking for. If he has a magic jammer, I might scream. I'm doing my best not to. It's late. My sister's sleeping. There we go. Alright. Now, obviously, I can't stop him if he has a card even a uh, after this. Uh, actually, I can't beat what he's got, so I might as well just put that down. And I better go. Like, I could beat the Trachodon, but that's about it. I need to, I need to beat the big boys, like Urbay and Crawling Dragon. Luckily, his trap didn't stop me, so... Let's see if he gets his red eyes. That'd be really cool. Didn't think so. Alright, Trachodon will take care of me. That's fine. Trachodon takes care of man -Ear Bug. man -Ear Bug does his awesome job of destroying the Urubi. Urubi. Get out of here. I draw. Swords. Yeah. Now I could be the annoying character. I'm just going to summon Great White. I know I can't beat you, and I know this is not exactly my field, but I know Summon Skull can, because Summon Skull is good on any field. There is no field in the world that can hurt Summon Skull. And no, don't list out field spells that would hurt Summon Skull. Leave me alone. Alright, 1600. There we go. And my turn, and 3500 life points left. Let's go. And it looks like he gave up. Thank God. Alright, Rex, you put me in a bit of a pickle, but I luckily got to my Mystical Space Typhoon, and I didn't let you stall me out. Now I'm gonna be able to attack with Summon Skull, and Summon Skull is gonna leave a nice dent in you. Oh, and that's not all. Great White's going back in there, and Great White's gonna get me another 16. Beautiful. I'm feeling real good about this. What? How can my dinosaurs lose, you dirtbag? Yeah, I love when he gets aggressive. Come on, man. Let's see, Garuzis, Great Mammoth, Brachioratus, hey, Rex Raptor, awesome dinosaur that he uses in Duels of the Roses, and an amazing Bones boss monster that I call Big G. Also, the best trap in the game, why did I not notice that? <laughs> Doesn't notice the best trap in the game? What's wrong with me? Um, I'm sorry. You're going in the deck. I don't know if anyone told you, but Royal Decree goes in the deck immediately. Do you not understand how powerful that card is? Get get, get in my deck. I should have just organized. Should have just organized. Or, you know, I'm going to do it. It's going to take too long. I've actually, I've pulled more cards than I realized. There's just a lot of garbage in my deck. Look how much faster that was. All right. Roll the Cree to the main deck, please. And Trunk, we're going to hit... I'm done with Horn of the Unicorn. It's had its value, but I'm done with it. Uh, let's go ahead and let's get into Weevil Underwood. Yeah, I would love to go to Insect Paradise. Why don't you show me, Insect? Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, crap. Weevil, come on, man. Just, you know what? It's fine. Just don't start with swords or anything like that. Okay. I do see the Summon Skull, and that could... Oh, yeah, that could be a problem. Change your heart, change your heart, change your heart. Damn it. Yep, that Summon Skull could be a problem. No, I... I, I, I didn't add anything else when you think about it. <clears throat> All I did was take out a spell for a trap, so... What what happened to my hand? Why is it pretending like I messed up my my monster ratio? I, I, didn't, I didn't touch my monster ratio. God damn it, game. I didn't touch the monster ratio. Why are you trying to make me break like I made a problem? Like I made a mistake. Uh-oh, flying Kamakiri. Yeah, you know what? This is probably going to be worth the mirror force now. Is this enough? And I hate the floaters, so, yeah. Yeah, 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 I get it. I get it. You're gonna force out my seven tools. But I gotta do it. 
not losing mirror force over this. Sometimes you got a seven tools of seven tools. Alright. That was a nice little animation there. Uh, Jesus Christ, dude! What? What's going on here? Game, come on! Give me a break! Thank you. I, you know what? I, I think of Wing Cleaver as a break. Thank you. Alright, now let's see if I can draw any level 4 monster, which I have many of. You know what? Level 3 will do. <laughs> I, I was going to get upset, but level 3 will do. I have Axe of Despair, but I'm not going to use it. Not time. This giant soldier has already been equipped too much before. And plus, what's going to be able to defeat him? I, I bet you Weevil doesn't have any cards that can defeat me. Show me, Weevil. Show me your strongest monster right now. <laughs> Lagool! Oh, okay, I, I'm not even mad. Come and get me. Come and get me. I am pretty low on life points, but you'd have to do that, what, 11 more times to kill me? That's actually... You know what? No. It's so funny, I'm going to Mystical Elf you in attack mode. I'm drawing all my defensive monsters instead of aggressive monsters. And they're still better than what you have left. That Mirror Force took your best cards. And you were probably thinking you're all safe because you have seven tools. You didn't expect the seven tools to counter the seven tools. You weren't ready for me. And your, you know, inability to prepare has cost you. Ah, oh, that's a little too strong. You know what? Yeah, I disagree. All right, let's see what we got. Neo, that's a much better card. All right, Neo, you can have the Axe of Despair. You can beat up monsters, no problem. I believe in you. All right, unless you got Snatch Deal, then I'd be super mad, but I just Fisher. If he ever got Snatch Deal, I'd just Fisher. It'd be fine. All right. Oh, wait, did he just die? Nah, he just died. <laughs> you know, the Magic Soul Swordsman end this duel. Holy crap, Weevil. The hand tried to screw me. It tried to make me think that my deck building was off. But uh-uh-uh. No, no, no. I haven't lost a duel with this deck building so far. Let me uh, get a Tiger Axe pack. Little D! Yeah! Um, Vermilion Sparrow! Yeah! No, none of that was good. But hopefully... Hopefully our weekly Yu-Gi-Oh will be good. We need something. Red Archery Girl, Green Kappa is not good enough. It's not bad. It's not good enough. Uh, two Now Gear is alright-ish. No, that was a terrible... Ar look, everyone else is telling me their weekly stuff gives them poly and all these rares. And then you look at me and I'm just like, please help. <laughs> please help me. I'm not getting those things. Mako, come here. I don't want to get stalled out by you. I know that's your whole deck idea. That's the only reason I have a loss in this entire Let's Play. Is because of your stall idea. And I've been pretty close to losses before. But, uh, you're the only one that pulled it off. Um, setting Dimensional Warrior is really funny. But, if I use Great White, he probably can't beat it unless he started with a, a beater monster. So, I feel good. I feel good. Great White is probably going to beat most of his cards. Yep, I was right. I got a right Gaki for it. Is that a mother star boy? Oh my god, I would love a star boy. I would love anything like that. If I can get effect monsters in general, I'd be happy. Alright, uh, Neo the Magic Swordsman, yeah. Do I just give him the axe every time? It's like, I know you're a magical swordsman, but you should be a mac- How about a magical axeman? Oh, that would just be a dwarf, huh? Oh no, they're usually hammers, right? I don't know. I don't know freaking anything. There should be a magical axeman, and the axe, like, the way... Oh, no, it's just... That's just Kratos. Never mind. I'm, I got it wrong. That's just Kratos. The magical axeman. All right, Umi's a problem. That means that their traps are now a possible stall, so I need to get rid of Umi. Uh, sword, stop defense. Not exactly going to get rid of Umi. Let's find out if he got Penguin Soldier early. That he did. That he did. At least I didn't run into it. Yeah, I lose my equip spell, but I did good damage with it. And yes, he could easily overpower my Neo the Magic Swordsman, but... You know, we got rid of the Penguin Soldier, and that makes me feel good. My one issue, though, is if you were to do it... I only have his swords. It's fine. I should be fine. I have a Giant Soldier of Stone for worst-case scenario. Mmm... Stalling for Tornado Wall. 
and Magic Jammer. My greatest weakness. Alright, I'm a little upset now. Slightly upset. Not too upset, slightly. Also, that field spell counters Machine King, so I can't even play aggressively. I got an MST. We're gonna play Swords ourselves. See if there's a Magic Jammer. Doesn't look like it. Okay. We're going to activate MST. We're gonna get rid of Umi before it becomes a problem. It's better to do it when Tornado Wall's already up, I understand that, but screw it. Uh, then we're going to play... You know what, we're just going to keep setting cards. Um, and then eventually we'll go in and get them. So I probably just baited him into attack mode by playing that. I did. Good. Good. Still can't beat me, though. Oh, hello there. You love to hold on to those equip spells. But Swords is protecting me, just like his is protecting him. Okay, I know what I'm going to do. I know exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to hurt you. I don't want to, but I have to, because of what you've done to me. That's actually my monster. You can't have that. Your swords is gone. Did you know that? Did you know you're in danger? You're in danger, sir. Alright, I'm curious enough to find out. Do you have a trap hole right now? Because I haven't really given you an option to show me a trap hole. No. So there's a possibility that that is the most annoying trap card in the game. Mirror Force. I need an MST. Potagree can help. I did not get MST. Potagree can help. I'll even take a giant trune. Giant trune would be great. Dear God. Okay, we're running into it. Running into it. That's gonna that's gonna be my play. Dimensional Warrior, get over here. And that's all my monsters. Yep, let's do it. Let's see who is stronger. Machine King, now that there's no Umi, you could easily defeat the Fiend Kraken. Thank God it was a mirror force, my god. Could have been so bad. Alright, what is this card? Great wide in defense mode. You gotta love that. Uh, since I want to keep Dimensional Warrior, I'm going to attack with this. I'm not banishing two of my own cards. That's just foolish. Dimensional Warrior is doing good work. And Morphing Jar. Don't think I'm not afraid to have you in attack mode. We have swords and we have a backup swords in our hand. So I have no fear in my heart. Plus I have Magic Jammer in case they get another Umi. From what I just did. They didn't. Life is good. Although I did increase the chances of Mirror Force being down there, so I gotta be careful with that too. Uh, you know what? Let's just go for game. Assume it's not Mirror Force. Maybe it's a trap hole. Yep, Red Archer Tree Girl. Okay, we can beat that. Uh, assuming that it is a Mirror Force, or a trap hole, not Mirror Force. Oh god, it was. Oh, oh dear god. Um, who do I not need? This guy and this guy can end the duel themselves. You could be in defense mode in case something bad happens. Since you have value. Alright, let's see it. Nope, just negate attack. Okay, it's all good, folks. <sighs> okay. <laughs> this guy loves to scare me. Damn it, he played another one. God freaking damn it. Oh, thank God. Alright. Well, let's deal with it. The other card, th this is the only problematic card. You better believe I'm going to find out what it is. What was it? Was it the Mirror Force? Nah, just a Trap Hole. There's the Trap Hole. Alright, now I think we're good. I think we can have game. So, Red Archery Girl. I'm going to get you with my Machine King. Expecting them to have a Penguin Soldier. Dimensional Warrior, this is where you kick in. I want you to banish that face down. I don't care what it is. We're going for game. Oh, another one. <laughs> His mom lets him have two. Alright, well, since that's happened, we're going to banish that. And uh, that's a nice sound effect for banishing. I must admit, I like the sound effect. And finally, we're going to attack. I feel like my opponent stalled me a lot today. I had to deal with a lot of bullcrap in today's episode, didn't I? But, at the end of the day, I still won. Oh, I'll get you. We're almost to ten wins on you. Which one of these is a water pack? I guess this is the closest, since it has sui Jin. I got Uguchi, I guess. Yay, attack directly. Big guy's not terrible. Jinzo number seven is actually one of the better attackers, so that's cool. And the rest of these could be damned. So, guys, that's going to be it for this one. Next episode, we're going to have a weekend duel, which it better not be Esperoba, I swear to God. Um, please remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all then. Bye bye